Hey. Hey. What a nice surprise. I wanted to see a friendly face. Well, come on in. Coffee? Yeah. Well, I'm glad that you stopped by. Yeah, I, just, I got into a fight with my roommate. I wanted a happy place, so that's why I'm here. Well, I'm happy that I make you happy. Mm -hmm. I'm not doing anything tonight. You can just sit here, watch movies, talk, whatever. It sounds really good, but I have a couple of things to do with my friends tonight, mm -hmm. and I would invite you but it's just not the right time to meet them yet. That's all right. We got plenty of time to meet them. You're sweet. You sure you want to hang out with an old lady like me? Well, I really like old ladies. <laughs> Thanks. So, what's your favorite color? Blue. Mm, okay. You know what? I put red underneath, so I guess you just don't want to see this. So I'm just gonna... I'm gonna... Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Wanna go? <laughs> No, no, I'm okay. I'm just, just shaken up, I guess. I've never been through a situation like that before and I just, I didn't know what to do. I'm so scared. I didn't know that you were gay. I fell asleep at Julie's house with makeup on and smudged all over my face. Blake. I didn't know what they were going to do to me. At one point, one of them took out a knife and had it this close to my neck. How did you get out of there? Some old man with a big dog came by and he started shouting and chasing them and scared them off. And I've never been so grateful for someone in my life. Should we go to the hospital? Should we go to the police? No, it's okay. The man called the police. They came and I filed a report. I don't think it's gonna do anything though. I don't know how someone can treat another human like that though, you know? Why does my sexual orientation offend them so much? Why do they fucking care? <laughs> Some people just feel like they're entitled to other people's lives. I'm so sorry. People are assholes. Oh, Haley, happy birthday. How have you been? <laughs> um, I'm good. How's, how's the shop? How's, how's everything? It's good. Surviving, I guess. Yeah. Are you ready for the workshop? I... I don't think I am, um, but I'm open-minded, so... It'll be fine. The woman coming tonight is fantastic. Yeah? I hear she's one of the best. Happy birthday. Thanks, Mesa. You're still coming out tonight, right? After this? Yeah, it's the plan. Is it okay? Yeah, of, of course, but I really need to tell you something. Um... Hi! Hi! Hey, what do you want to tell me? Oh. It can wait, but 
before the club, okay? Yeah, sure. Mark has got roughed up today. What? what? Are you okay? Guys, I'm fine. Oh my god. It was just a little scare. It wasn't the proudest moment of my life, but I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay? Yes. Oh my god. Whoa. <laughs> no comment. Everybody, are we all set today? Yeah. Marcus, Drew. Hi, I'm sorry. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Woo! I'm so happy to introduce you to your sexual and wellness educator, Miss Jones. Yeah. Yay! Hello, everybody. Are we excited today? Are we happy? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So I'm a sexual wellness educator. I create safe spaces and hold spaces for people of all genders to explore, talk about sexuality, risk, be vulnerable. I do that through coaching, bodywork, workshops. So today is Spanking 101. Woo! When I take my clothes off in my workshops, I like people to clap. <laughs> And today, Mesa will be my model. Oh, not Ollie? Ooh. I think it should be Ollie. <laughs> it is my birthday. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, no, I don't work like that. You should always keep in mind the four C's. Caring, communication, caution, consent. They, it's a motto in BDSM, but I think it's applicable to anything we do in life. Kinky, not kinky, whatever you want to do it. It's a spectrum. We've had this discussion. I went over a few ideas with her. Um, about how I'm gonna work, I looked into her past history and we negotiated. You do this with people. You know, I don't just do this with my clients. People and partners need to do these. Here are some implements you can use or you can call them tools or weapons of mass destruction. You have your crops. Pretty colors. You have wooden paddles. All different shapes and sizes. Another paddle. And it's got a lovely little hole here so you can hook it up to your pants. And some tools for spanking are made of leather. Woo! Oh, I want you to lie down because it supports your back. Be very, you can hang over. These nice little things down here, I could actually get cuffs and cuff her to it. This thing is made of leather. And this is good. Before I try this on my partner, try it on your wrist. Because then you can feel it in your hand. If you want to test it out, you can try it on your hand. Oh, Ollie, you look good holding that. The strapping and what? Mm hmm. <laughs> I see what you did there. Yeah, so funny, Blake. Oh, I missed that. Do it again. Oh. Now do me. It's okay. Just do it, Ollie. Woo! Again. Woo! <laughs> oh, it's fun. You're good at that. She's just unfazed. It doesn't phase her. <clears throat> I am not ready. Let me do tequila again. Do not. That's your problem. You can do what you like. I'm not here. Yeah, take this. We got to go on. Do tequila for death. Oh no. Hey, Mesa. Before we go mm -hmm. in, I just mm -hmm. wanted to talk to you about something. Yeah, sure. What's up? Um, Ollie. Hey. Hey. Happy birthday. Um. This is Jennifer. Um, guys. Nice to here. meet you, Jennifer. Nice to meet you. This is Jennifer. We've been seeing each other for a little bit now. Lisa? You okay, sweetie? Yeah, peachy. You weren't expecting that, were you? No. I mean, I didn't want to feel the way I did when I saw her kiss him. No. Well, what about Sai, though? You've been seeing him. Yeah, but I don't know. When I'm with him, it's just kind of like I'm living a different life. It's not real life. Like, living in a bubble room, I guess. I don't know. Did you love Ollie? Yeah. Yeah. 
And why did you end it? Because I was protecting myself. Mesa, wait, 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 wait. No, like, I don't like us fighting. I'm, I'm really sorry. Okay, I'm, I love you. I love you, and I'm sorry for our fight. Me too. This is your last chance with Ollie. Yeah. You have to get him now. No, you know what? He looks really happy, and I'm not gonna ruin that. Okay. But you so have I'm to be happy home. with him. Okay. I love you. I love you too. And I don't want to fight. Okay. Okay. Never again. Okay. I'm going home. Bye. I'll see you later. I'll see you later. Okay. Bye. 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 I'm going. Bye. Hey, Mesa, Mesa. Where are you going? Um, I'm so sorry. I'm just not feeling well. And, you know, Blake and I got into a fight last night, so it just kind of ruined the mood for me. I hope you have a good birthday, Ollie. It's Jennifer, isn't it? It bothers you to see me with someone else. No, look, no, you can't do this. I spent the last six months trying to figure out what the fuck I did wrong to mess this up. Mess I messed it up. I messed it up. I was so scared, okay? I was scared that I thought you would wake up and realize that you didn't actually love me. So that's why you broke up with me. My insecurities just took over my whole being. It was so much stronger than me. I was so in love with you that I thought that if I broke up with you before you realized anything that I could actually save myself. Oh. Hey, you were in love with me? Oh, I just can't be your friend. I'm so sorry. I just can't do it. So that's it. We just Go our separate ways. Do you know how many times I have been told that I am fun but not marriage material? It would have been a matter of time before you figured that out. Right, so what you're doing is you're lumping me with the category of those fucking losers that you dated before me, right? Those guys. That's that's how low you think of me. No, I think that low of myself. Honestly, I just don't want to do this with you right now. I am sorry that I am such an asshole and you deserve so much better than the way I treated you. Please just go. She's a grain of sand Between your fingertips, no doubt I'm on for 